Hello, I'm Simon Hill. I'm an editorial photographer living and working between West Cork in Ireland and North Yorkshire here in the UK. I'm absolutely flattered, honoured and to a certain degree surprised uh, to have won Expressions 2017. I'd like to thank the Committee of Expressions and the guest judge, of course, Matthias Kowalski from Poland, for selecting my image to be the winner of this year's competition. I'm following in the footsteps of two great photographers, Hoya Manolace from San Francisco and John Rich from Boston, Massachusetts. I've always thought the greatest potential of photography is in being able to record and document reality, uh, everyday life, whether that's the, the great and the good or the commonplace and mundane, which is why I suppose I'm an editorial photographer. Uh, I don't have a studio, all the photographs I take are out on location, portraits, landscapes obviously, events, functions, people and places, things that happen, everyday life, that's what I do as a photographer. I mean, a few years ago I saw some photographs, uh, or revisited some photographs, taken by Arnold Newman at the invitation of the Sunday Times magazine and the National Portrait Gallery. The exhibition was called The Great British and it aimed to document those figures of importance that had made Britain great. At the same time I came across a book called England in Particular by Angela King and Sue Clifford. It was published in 2006 by the Common Ground Trust and this book captured everything that was the commonplace, the ordinary, the mundane about Britain. And it struck me that there's a, a, a difference, a juxtaposition between the work of Arnold Newman, picturing the great and the good, and the book by King and Clifford, which captured the mundanity, the ordinary, uh, of, of England in particular and Britain as a whole. King and Clifford's book was unillustrated, uh, save for a few line illustrations, so that gave me the idea for, for the project of which this winning photograph is part. I wanted to quite literally focus on the individuals that make England so distinctive. I called the project The English in Particular. All of the photographs were shot on film, Ilford FB4, using a Hasselblad camera. I love the square format. It imposes nothing on the, on the viewer, um, allowing them to just look within the frame to, to what the photographers captured. Well, I hope you've all enjoyed looking at the photographs from this year's uh, exhibition, uh, Expressions Number 3, some superb uh, portrait photography. Hopefully you'll get an opportunity to look at the rest of the photographs from my project, the English in particular. Uh, and before I finish, I'd just like to thank the sitters, the many sitters that uh, took time and patience uh, to sit for me for, for my project. The winning photograph was taken here uh, in York Cemetery in North Yorkshire, England. Um, so a great big thank you to them. Well, good luck if you decide to enter Expressions 4 next year. I hope you do. Um, and thanks again to the judges and good luck with your photography. All the best.